The ancient Gulaga Kingdom, which comprises over 30 major communities and several satellite villages, is one of the highest oil producing areas in Delta. Despite playing hopes to the international and indigenous oil and gas companies like Shell Petroleum Development Company of Nigeria Limited, SPDC, Ajib Oil Company, Chevron Nigeria Limited and a host of others with over 300 oil wells, several gas reservoirs and other oil and gas facilities, the communities still grapple with underdevelopment. Dissatisfied with the status quo, the people in one accord send a strong worded letter to the presidency stating their demands, which include halting the current process of bidding for the ownership and operation of the marginal oil field and giving indigent of Ogulaga the right of first refusal in the bidding process of such oil fields in their communities, the resumption of the Gas Revolution Industrial Park project with Ogulaga Kingdom as part of the negotiators for the project forthwith, establishment of a federal university and or polytechnic, roads and dredges amongst other projects, appointing of indigent of the kingdom into boards of federal power statals and other establishment. In the event of failure or neglect to do so, the Ogula kingdom will not concede to give out any marginal field within his kingdom to any investor who is not an indigent of the kingdom. This is an emphasis. However, if the federal government neglects to eat this appeal, we shall shut down all oil and gas companies operating in Ogola Kingdom, including their facilities. The people also lament the negative effects of oil exploration activities on their health and livelihoods, amongst other things. Our fishes started dying in the river. Women cannot go to fishing. They cannot empower their children. They cannot pay school fees. We are living in advent poverty, right? Even at this hour of COVID-19, to start with, we don't even have an isolation center in this, in, this, in this kingdom. Federal government has neglected us for so long, for too long. They started oil exploration in this kingdom in 1959. Till date, if you talk in terms of employment, zero. The residents of Ogulaga Kingdom are threatening to shut down oil and gas installations in their communities unless moves are made to urgently resolve these issues.